In this video, we are learning how to sit in seiza. Now, seiza is a typical way of sitting in Japanese society. Well, I should say Japanese culture. And it is very useful to remember how to do it. Most importantly, in Kendo, we are sitting in seiza all the time. Now you are looking at a picture with a person who is sitting in seiza. Now this is the final position of seiza and I want you to see now uh, how you're gonna sit in seiza from standing position. Okay, now let's watch it again. Make sure you are in tighter position. And kneel down the left foot first and the right foot and sit and place your shinai quietly. Now you're in taito position and left foot goes back and kneel down. And now right knee and quietly sit down and place your shinai on the floor and your hands on the thighs. Now I want you to be careful with the position of tsuba. As you can see in the picture, the tsuba is right next to the left knee. Okay, it's not far front or far back from the left knee. Okay, so when you place your shinai down, make sure the tsuba comes right next to the left knee. Now I want you to look from the back. Okay, now I'm going to talk a bit about toes. Okay, now I want you to look at the toes. Um, the right big toe is on top of the left big toe, right? Okay, this is how you're supposed to sit in seiza. Okay, this is how you're supposed to have your big toes when you sit in seiza. Okay, this is how I learned and I don't know, uh, some people have their right foot on the uh, left foot when they sit in seiza. Uh, I don't know if they were taught that way, but uh, the way you were looking at in the picture was what I taught. So uh, if you don't have any teachers around and this is the first time for you to learn kendo, uh, let's stick to this way, okay? Let's see how to sit in seiza once again before we finish. Taito first and left knee, right knee and sit on the heels and quietly put Shinai down. Okay, that's it for today and thank you for watching this video. And I would like to thank Atsushiwada and Itami Sports Center Kindle Club for their cooperation.